Hey everyone, so today I am back to show you how I deep clean my brushes. I think it's really important to keep these makeup brushes clean because you don't want dirt, oils, bacteria that will build up in the brushes that will cause breakout. So today I will be sharing some tips and tricks for the maintenance of my favorite brushes. And this is the cleaning kit that I will be using today. If you don't have this cleaning kit, stick to the end and I will show you some awesome alternatives that I have used in the past. So first I like to squeeze about the size of a sunflower seed amount of the squeaky shampoo into the cup and add just a moderate amount of water. Now it is definitely important that when you are scrubbing your brushes in the cup or on your hand, you don't want to get any water into the ferrule of the brush. This is especially important because you don't want the water to seep through and get to the ferrule and then break up the glue that's holding the bristles together then you'll get a lot more fallout and it's just going to ruin your brushes. So as you can see here I am just drying my brush and squeezing out any excess water and I will just use a brush guard and let it dry in the drying cup. Now I also do the exact same thing that I did earlier here add you know a moderate amount of water scrub and with thicker brushes like a kabuki brush, I like to do two to three water scrubbings basically. And I like to squeeze out any excess water, then I dry it. And with a kabuki brush, I like to cut a brush guard in half because it's so short and I just spit it over the kabuki brush and let it dry. And I forgot to mention, but this cup has little grooves there so it helps with the scrubbing, but you can definitely use your... Um, the inside part of your hands. As you can see here, because I'm lazy, I decided to get most to all of my eye brushes at once. And I like to dry them all at once and then dry them individually. I like to follow the natural shape of the brush so I don't damage them in any way. And once I'm done, I finally fit each brush with a brush guard. Now for those wondering about alternatives, if you don't have this cleaning kit, I usually like to use some baby shampoo alone, or I like to use some antibacterial soap with some extra virgin olive oil, and this is just going to maintain the softness of my brushes while keeping them clean. Now for those that do not have a cup that's big enough to fit all of your brushes and you like to clean all of your brushes at once, I would just go ahead and make sure you shape your brushes and then you can lay them at an elevated surface like a folded towel here. Just let this dry overnight. With the kabuki brushes, those may take a bit longer, up to two days, especially the thicker ones, but generally everything should dry overnight and you are ready to take off the brush guards.